Hello everyone, my name is Loco and welcome to some more Hearthstone. Today it is time to check out the latest Tavern Brawl. A lot of you have actually mentioned that apparently this week's one is really, really cool. I haven't checked it out yet, I don't know what it's about. It's just a little surprising that so many of you were mentioning, hey, you should really go ahead and check out the new Tavern Brawl. So here we go, let's read the rules. That's crazy rules. Return of Magazot. Magazot wants a rematch. This time, new allies stand against him. Good luck with the return of the co-op brawl. <gasps> That's awesome. Oh, I'm Medivh. I love that animation. Let the games begin. Let the games begin, indeed. So it's a co-op one. I know that there was one of those in the past as well. Although I haven't, I have not actually played it before. I have no idea how this works, but we'll figure it out together. Uh, we got Arcane Blast. Deal two damage to a minion. This spell gets double bonus from spell damage. We got the Forgotten Torch, and we got the Erden Farseer as well. I have no idea what kind of cards I am running in this deck. So I'm guessing I want to look for something a little better than that. Not this, though. This is not that great. Anyways, guess we'll figure out what's going on. Job's done. Wait. Mechasoid wins if he defeats either of you? Oh, I see how this goes. Alright, so we are playing together. Charney, Voot, and me are working together against Gearmaster Mechasoid, who has 95 health. Interesting. I have absolutely nothing here. Oh, alright. I see how this works. I see how this works. So he's gonna be switching position every turn. Okay, cool. Alright, let's say greetings to our ally, I suppose. I was gonna say opponent, but no, he's gonna be an ally at this point. Alright, so he's gonna be dealing damage to us, and we will need to figure out a way to deal with him. Now, so far... Can I even damage him? I can damage him as well, but, I mean, we, we shouldn't be doing that. Deal attack damage to the biggest minion. Alright, alright, that's fine for us. So he's gonna be able to do a turn as well every single time we are switching turns, which is kind of tricky. Uh, I did just draw into the beast, which is interesting, but I guess Refreshment Fender immediately becomes the strongest card in the game, right? Am I crazy for saying that? Like, Refreshment Fender, since it's healing up both of us, should be extremely useful. Now, we don't get to create a deck or anything like that. So, yeah, we'll, we'll have to figure that out. Um... Man, I guess I'll just play the Geomancer then. I have nothing to play. I guess I shouldn't have Mulliganed like that. Alright. Time to start hitting him in the face. He has only two attacks, so it's not all that scary. He just has a lot of life. A lot of life, and we're starting to run low already. Come on, Charney Foot. We got this, sir. Okay. Thank you for the mana crystal. That is very generous. Um. Alright, so he went for Overclock, which gives him now four attack. Really? Hmm. Let's see. So, Refreshment Fender would be alright here, but I'm guessing Azure Drake makes a little more sense. Just because we get a ton of damage out of the Fireball that way next turn. Alright. We'll go for the Cold Light Oracle next, maybe, as well. Okay, that's good, actually. That's actually very good for us. So... The, the Cold Light Farce obviously also gives me another attack. Hmm. And the, uh, or uh, rather the Cold Light Farseer, or Overseer, no, Oracle rather, Cold Light Oracle will draw cards for both of us. I did just get Leroy as well. I also now have the Beast. I mean, it says summon a 3-3 Fickle Iron Whore for my opponent, but... I mean, that's technically, that's technically my ally, right? I think we're just gonna have to start. We could go for the Fireball here, which is very useful. It does a lot of damage. But I guess the beast is just a little too good to pass up, right? Which I think, when the when the beast dies, it will give my ally a 3-3. Not him, right? He's not gonna be able to get any more cards. We really need some sort of silence, though. I hope we get some sort of silence soon. We can go Fireball, Refreshment, Fender, or, um, you know, some Cold Light, you know, Oracle in the next turn. So one of those two, and then one of the Cold Light Oracles. Alright, he's gonna start wrathing. We have no silence though. I also have the uh, the pyroblast ready to go, obviously, which is quite nice. Oh man, eight damage straight to my face. I have like nothing. Okay, so this one benefits a ton from the spell damage. I think we'll basically have to go ahead here and play uh, play that. No good reason not to. I could be going for anything here, but I mean the problem is. The problem is that, uh, I guess I'll give him, like, I could heal myself up and him as well. Funnel cakes. Get your funnel cakes here. 
Yeah, I guess I guess we'll just have to run it in. The thing is, like, he is getting more and more attack here, and we don't have any way of silencing him. So I guess we'll just attack, which I'm assuming gives my ally a 3-3. Yeah. So that's that I guess is alright. Alright. Man, I am actually dead in the next turn. If we're not careful here, we could very well be dead. I mean, he's not even close to dying yet. <laughs> We're getting dominated here. Like, if you have a silence, that would be an easy way of dealing with this. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. That's very generous of him. Alright, we're gonna start running in minions apparently now. Oof, that's fine. 70 HP. And I guess we'll start fireballing then? Fireball would, would make at least a little bit of sense. I guess I'll give my ally a bit of card roll. We'll see what we get first. Your hero can take only one damage uh, at a time. Oh! Oh! Your hero can take only one damage at a time. That's fine then, right? <clears throat> That's actually very good for us. I'll go ahead and run in the Refreshment Fender because why the heck not? I will just be ending a turn. I don't know if we have any kind of sil like silence in our decks. There may very well not be any silence available. Oh man, my ally is starting to fall low though. Hmm. Alright, he's gonna start healing himself up. If I get any kind of healing spell, I will use that on him as well, but... I mean... Oh, the zombie chows are also very nice. No, no, okay, good. Not to his face at the very least. So he's gonna be healing me up. I guess I'll heal him then, right? We're working together here. Giving him a little bit extra healing. I guess, I guess we'll just, you know, I guess we'll go for the Blood Mage Talnos and start fireballing like mad. That was 8 damage there, but I mean, I don't, I don't want to lose my animated armor. The animated armor is what's keeping me alive here. Okay, this is fine, this is fine. Oh, he's a 2 attack, or 2 health rather. Oh man, those juggles were not in our favor. Okay. I hope he has some sort of healing in hand here. Obviously, we have no communication. I wish we had something to reduce that attack. But I guess that didn't give us anything like that. I got a Pyroblast in hand, sir. But I mean, I don't think you can do 41 damage here, right? Something like that. No, not 41. I'm not gonna do math. 47. There we go, I did it. Alright, he's got Stalak as well. We have healing? <gasps> nice. Nice, nice, nice. Together we can do this. Okay, he's gonna overclock again, get more attack. Well played. Um, I guess we just keep on playing... You know, those kind of cards. We can use Leroy to sort of like give him some more... Sustain out on the board and like... Make the chance of him juggling... Like in his favor a little weaker. I guess we'll do that. We'll just play it. Let's hit him, hit him in the face with it, and just sort of give like two more additional targets to get hit by like his like AOE juggle. He's just gonna keep on overclocking here? Oh man. Obviously if he attacks both players, we are done for, but... I mean, how do I communicate with him that I can deal 13 damage in the next turn? 13 plus 8? Ooh. Just, you should probably go ahead and hit him, sir. I may have lethal. I may have lethal here. We'd have to check it out, but... Let's see, let's see. No! No! Oh, come on! I had 8... 10... 11... Oh, man. I know I didn't have lethal. <sighs> that is real unfortunate. Alright, alright. We got a different ally now. But I'm once again Medivh. I don't want any of those cards. I just do not want them. I guess the the, the farce here I can use, but I want to have like spell damage minions here for the most part. Like, give me a cobalt. Alright, this is also fine. This is also fine. Brown Bronze turn three. Oh, here goes nothing. Ah. I will clench to both of the Curse of Flash. A Flash Rudder. Oh man. He's immediately gonna start overclocking here. Which is not very helpful for us. 
do it, Vanquir. We got this, man. We can do this together. All right, you're gonna get some free mana crystals. That's fine. And here the damage starts warping in again, or like starts boosting in. Uh, not much I can do. Guess we just pick him down. He's already gonna be up to six attack, much quicker than we were in the previous game, which is not good for us. Like he is starting to do a lot of damage real quick. I guess that's because we haven't played any minions. He may be doing it that way, yeah. Oh man. Well, I mean, I guess I guess I'll go Brand Bronzebeard. I hope he doesn't kill him. That would be great if he doesn't kill him. Great. All right, so we can go refreshments fender and hopefully, hopefully get two card draws out of Azure Drake. He's already at eight attack though. Eight attack is stupid high. <sighs> Maybe we can build up a bit of a board now, considering he's likely to start attacking our faces. But I mean, we don't have enough healing to really keep this up for much longer. All right, he's gonna go for the one damage or the three damage. Probably the one. Yep. And a haunted creeper. Whew. What did he ever do to you, man? This is terrible. Absolutely awful. Like we haven't really gotten anything anything useful yet. <laughs> Come on. No! Okay, okay. I thought you were going for the refreshment fender. Looks like I've got a minion alive. Although I only have eight health remaining. Thank you, sir. I guess I'm the one that is actually like dealing damage, but I mean I can't really do very much of it so far. Ooh, I would have been dead. We're actually both very dead in the next turn. Maybe my opponent can do something with bananas? I highly doubt it. It's not gonna make a difference. Oh, I needed you a little sooner. No. Man! The double lethal. Alright, this time we're gonna do it though. We're gonna do it. I am once again Mediv. I'm once again going to be playing the mage. Animated armor is probably very, very good here to get it with the refreshment fender. Should I keep the mirror entity? Probably not. Probably not. We'll keep the animated armor just because it's so good and it gives me like a lot of extra sustain. Okay, we got a solid opener hand now. We got a good opener hand. I hope he's got something good as well. We went straight for the well played here instead of greetings. Alright. Alright. Prioritize is probably our best luck here. Ah, hello there. The raspy voice of Mediv. Okay, we can do this. Guide my lance. Okay, okay, it's still up. It's still up. Guess we'll go for the cobalt. Do not take my candle, sir. I got a little lucky there. But I guess, I don't know what's more valuable here, the one mana crystal? Like, probably. It's probably more valuable than my kobold is, but... We'll give him uh, King Mukla here in the next turn. I mean... Actually, we could also go Bran Bronzebeard and play King Mukla later. Imagining, or like, hoping that uh, the Bran survives. Mukla is still pretty powerful. Although he's up at 4 attack right now, which makes this kind of scary. Although Arcane Golem also gives a lot of, gets a lot of value from Bran, so we'll do it this way. We'll do it this way and hope that Bran stays alive. Okay, good. Cool. That was fine. So I wanna give my opponent either like an extra mana crystal. I'll give him two mana crystals from the Arcane Golem. Which will, you know, be given to him by Bran. And that will probably like Arcane Blast. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. I got my I got my my armor ready to go as well, but here we go. Oh man. We can get so much value out of this. Uh, I'll give him I'll say greetings. There you go. There you go, man. Get all the mana crystals you want. Good guy Loco. Having your back. Actually, I don't want to attack here because I want to give him an extra target to hit if he goes for that biggest priority thing or like the biggest minion thing, which would be which would be Brand's Bronbeard. Yeah, there we go. 
Cool. Alright, this way we can give him another, you know, mana crystal. We'll give him another mana crystal here. Or like, you know, four bananas. Do you think he prefers four bananas? It's gonna fill up his hand really quickly. <laughs> I don't know if I'm actually aiding him by giving him four bananas, but... Hey, uh, he can make a sick fucking, like, haunted creeper. Nobody's seen that before. Brown Rosebird is actually super important here. Alright, if you play another spell here, I'll give you four... I'll give you four bananas. Well, oh, you're making good use right here with the free mana crystals, I see, huh? No, bro! Whoa, why would you do that? Don't do it! Alright. Here, have four bananas. I know you always wanted those. How many cards does he have? He has five right now. Here we go. Get him! Get him, bro! There you go. Give him give him some more. <laughs> he can still card he can still draw one card. It's fine. Okay. Oh, oh man. I wish I had a way to give the animated armor to him. What did we draw into, by the way? Troc Zord Earthenator. Whenever your opponent casts a spell, summon a burly rockjaw troc. Ooh. That's pretty good. I'm not too worried about my health actually here. But hey. Oh! Oh, that's actually brilliant! Oh, we can heal ourselves up with Lord Walker Cho! We can like return to favor! I'll give him some more mana crystals then. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh, okay, okay. The only thing we need to keep on doing is keep touching, like keep throwing this thing over. Holy shit, that is some Chor Lord Walker Cho value right here, if I've ever seen any. That's insane. Alright, so I heal him up here. We'll return to favor. There you go, give him one, Lore. I guess I gotta be a little careful here using my, my uh, bananas, because he's just gonna start running out of space. We'll go ahead and give him a maxed out amount of, you know, a maxed out amount of stuff. <clears throat> and I think Lord Walker Chorm, or like, um, what's his name, Brent Brolsbeard may very well go down here, but this is fine. Oh! What?! Oh, man! <laughs> we had some sick value out of the Lord Walker, no? Giving ourselves so many healing touches. Alright, we'll go for the animated armor now. Or maybe we'll just go for the Troxor. No, the Troxor is actually very good. Especially if he goes for the uh, Violet Teacher. I don't know if he still has any spells in hand here. That that was a misplay right there if I've se ever seen any, man. Oh well. I am ready to learn. My opponent's sadly making some minor mistakes. That's okay. We could have gotten a lot of value out of Troxor as well, knowing he had a lot of bananas. I mean, I'm not too worried about my attack or my health right now. Although he's still at a heck of a lot of health himself, but I hope he knows. I hope he knows this uh, this card, or at least he reads it. Oh man! All right, never mind. That's that's a turn wasted. I'm hoping he's gonna get some sort of like ancient lore or whatever, so he can start drawing some cards. Cause he, yeah, he keeps playing good stuff. Oh, there we go. Are you gonna heal? Please, please don't heal. Good. We need to start, like, chaining in attacks. How many cards do I have? He's got 17, I got 20 left in my deck. There's a lot of spells in my deck. Okay, give me a card. I appreciate that. Give adjacent minions plus one spell damage. Great. We can give him one spell damage if we're not careful. Alright, we'll go for the animated armor now. There we go. And since um, he has a bunch of really big minions now... Oh my god, it's actually gonna count twice? Ooh, that Kirin Tormage here. I'm secretly hoping I'm gonna draw into my spells. Alright, so sadly that's the... Uh, that's his minion gone, but that's fine. I mean, she had a lot of attack, I suppose, but this is all right. I can only take one damage at a time now to the face, which is very good. 
It's gonna go straight into Fugan. Ooh, the Pyro Blast. Guess we can start banking up for that one. With Blood Mage Tunnels. Throw around some bananas. Go for the Beast. Alright. Alright, I'm feeling confident in this one. I'm just hoping my opponent won't go down here. We're both, we're both trying to build up a board. No lack of misplays, that's for sure. Wait, so if you get enough minions out on a board, does he always go for that spell? He could very well always be going for that then. I guess the beast is just a little too good to pass up here. Or we can go for Blood Mage Talnos, Cobalt Geomancer, Mirror Entity, and a whole bunch of bananas. Um, we'll give you a banana, and we'll give you a banana as well. No, we'll give you a banana. I don't want to have any, like, too big of a minion out either. Because it just messes up a lot of the things. So Fugan is going to be the biggest priority now. Okay, so we can do... How much is this? 16 damage with a Pyroblast here. 16 damage is a lot. We need to start hitting that thing in the face, sir. Let's go. Let's go. This is well played so far. I mean, a couple misplays, but that's okay. Let's do this. I'm feeling confident in our abilities. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be, but... Wait, is he gonna go for it? Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Hit him! Hit him in the face! He does 10 damage a turn right now, man. We need to start cleaning this shit up. Okay, this is fine for us. Oh, man. Does that actually also take away the spell? No, actually it doesn't. It's just the teachings. Cool. Oh, well. We'll go for the fireball then. And also go for the beast. Which is fine. Which is fine. Don't think I want to run in scenarios, do I? Do I? Maybe I do. Yeah, we'll just do it. We'll just do it. I can still only take one damage a turn here. He's gaining a bunch of extra attack. Not quite enough to do lethal yet, though. I got 13, 16. Oh, there we go. He's gonna go for the 11, 11. 11, 11 Thaddeus. Or Thaddeus, something like that. We'll go for the Pyroblast next, though. I think we get too much value out of that. We got 10, 14. No, 10, 13, 17, 19, and 19 plus 16 is 35. 35 damage. My opponent can do 6. Um, well, it's my ally, I suppose. Yes! Good good reading skills, sir. Do we have lethal here? Hit him in the face as well with the 8-9. Please do him with the 8-9. Attack, attack, attack. Do it, do it. No. Do it! Do it! <laughs> okay. Hit with the 8-9, bro! Do it! Do it! <laughs> I, yes! Okay. Good, 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 good. Whew. Do I have enough here? 16? 25, 26, 26 plus 7, 33. <gasps> I've got 6. Wait, I got 6, 9, 10. Yes! <laughs> that was awesome! That was really cool! We managed to gain victory after all. I hope you enjoyed watching this game. If you haven't already, hit the like button. If you want to see more content like this, hit that subscribe button. But wait, we need to open up one pack as well. Oh man, I almost forgot doing this. Here we go. I'm ready. Sylvanas, come into my collection. <gasps> we got a legendary. Sylvanas, I've been looking for you for such a long time. Legendary. Well, Gromash Hellscream.
I didn't actually have Grimage Hell's Cream. What a sweet, sweet tavern brawl. All right, once again, I want to thank you all for watching. Have an amazing day. Do not forget to smile. And I'll see you in the next one. Boom!